The Northern Hemisphere's ice sheets underwent significant changes during the last glacial cycle, as simulated by the glacial index method. This method uses climate forcing from one general circulation model, GCM, to compare its results to geologic reconstructions. While the GCM accurately captured some key features of the ice sheet's evolution, it also had large discrepancies. These discrepancies were attributed to the lack of nonlinear interactions between the ice sheet and other climate components. To further examine these discrepancies, the authors used nine climate models from the Paleoclimate Modeling Intercomparison Project Phase 3. They found that the ice sheet's summer surface air temperature pattern matched the upper boundary conditions of the models, suggesting that the upper boundary condition was the primary driver of the ice sheet's evolution. This study highlighted the importance of carefully constraining climate output when simulating realistic northern hemisphere ice sheets. This article was authored by LUNRU, Garrett Lohman, Sebastian Hink, and others. We are article.tv, links in the description below.